Hello and welcome to The Escapists, a brand new game that's currently in alpha stages, developed by Moldy Tooth Studios and published by Team17, the Worms publishers. Um, so it's good to see them doing something else other than Worms uh, for a change, which is quite nice. And uh, The Escapists, basically, uh, you play this character in the game. Um, who is trying to escape from prison, I guess. So if you've ever enjoyed Prison Architect or anything like that, then your prison knowledge will uh, definitely come in handy here, I reckon. Um, but yeah, I mean, very different game from uh, anything else I've really played before, which is why I'm enjoying it so much. I've played a little bit of it, and um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. So uh, it looks a little, you know, 8-bit and pixely and all that, but, uh, you know, it's the gameplay that counts. So... Inmate name, let's call ourselves um, Tank, I guess. Uh, we will be Tank, the inmate. And um, now I'm just going to pause the game so I can just chat to you a little bit before we kick things off. Um, you know, as the game will tell you shortly, it's all about routine and, you know, you have to stick to your routine. And your point is to, you, you know, your goal is to get out of the prison. So while you're doing the routine, you're going to need to try and escape. <coughs> So keeping up with those routines and stuff, uh, these are the things that will help you out. Uh, in the top corner you've got your cash, which uh, you can get money from other inmates by helping them out and doing them favours. I'm not talking about the shower kind of favours, but just general favours, finding things for them, returning things for them, and so on and so forth. You've then got your health, which, can, uh, which shows how much of a beating you can take. Um, also how much of a beating you give to others, I would imagine. Um, you know, that can go up and down based on how healthy you are or how much you gym in the exercise periods. Uh, the guard heat is how suspicious the guards are of you. Um, so if you're in someone else's cell and they walk past, your suspicion will go up, obviously. And um, the fatigue, how tired you are, that gets sorted and fixed by resting, sitting, sleeping, eating and showering. Um, and then obviously if you're digging a hole in your jail cell, um, you know, your fatigue's going to go up as you continue digging through the night. <coughs> so let's kick right into it. Um, I'm still having fat snoozes here on the bed, um, and my fatigue is going down, uh, which is good. And lights out at the moment, when we have morning roll call, there goes the bell. And all the prisoners, like clockwork, jump into the area. Now, in terms of questing, this guy here has got an exclamation mark over his head. You can see I'm going to click him, he's going to tell me that a little birdie told me that Mike's been seen with my missing pack of playing cards. Mind retrieving it for me, $19. I'm going to take that quest. And then there's another one here by Stuart. Officer Raphael raided my cell yesterday and took my toothbrush shiv. Could you get me it back? See, now I'm not too interested in that at the moment because I don't really know how to steal from officers. So I'm going to say no, and hopefully that disappears and it does. And Lee's got another one. So I paid Chris good money for a bottle of medicine. He never delivered. Get it for me and I'll pay you for the trouble. $19. That sounds great. Okay, these guys are deciding to fight for some reason. Um, let's have a look. You can loot his body, which I'm going to do. Um, he's got a spatula on him. Now you can see the different items here. The ones are green, ones are red. So the green ones are obviously legal and fine to have on you. So a pack of smokes, perfect. Uh, spatula, mmm, not so good. Now spatula, obviously it's red, so whenever you go through any of the little uh, detectors, uh, the red items will pop up and the guards will beat the crap out of you. So yeah, I'm going to get away from the violence here. These guys are both down for the count as well. Um, I'm just hoping that the guards... I'd like to take... I'd like to take that trial. I'd really like to take that trial. But obviously... And I'm going to take it. Nope, that's the wrong person. Nope, that's the wrong person too. Where did the trial go? Well, I can get some timber, I guess. And some sleeping pills or something. Oh, God. So it's breakfast time now. That was unfortunate. I would have loved to have had a trial in the first night. Um, but yeah... I can't obviously have one at the moment. There's another person down for the count. He's got some duct tape and some cooked food. I'm going to have to go back and put this in my cell because I'm not going to be able to go through the canteen because there's a detector there. So I'm going to have to stick this duct tape in and by the time I get to breakfast it's uh, going to be a bit late. So I might as well just jump in and I don't know, try and loot someone's desk for the time being. Okay, so desk looted and nothing of interest there, so let's escape quickly. Breakfast is almost over, and now we can head off to our work. Um, 
Let's see, oh, it's a bit disappointing. That sounds like another fight. Let me see if I can go and pick some things up. And there's the man who's down, and he's got nothing on him apart from a bed sheet and a watch, which I do not want. So yeah, let me do my job here quickly. Um, I've just I want to drop this food on the ground at the moment, just so I can do this properly. So I'm gonna have to put dirty laundry in the laundry machines and take out clean, 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 and then deposit them to fill up my job quota. Now obviously I can take one of these uniforms and you know it might be a decent idea but at the moment I don't really know what to do with them. I'm kind of hoping for one specific uh, scenario. Uh, interestingly enough I have had a number of different things happen um, like I did file through the bars um, and then I obviously just got caught and thrown into solitary and all my hard work was uh, wasted. So yeah, that's my laundry laundry day done. Let's have a look at my journal. I need to get Lee's pack of plan cards from Mike and a bottle of medicine from Chris. Okay, so let's have a look here. Let's find their desks. So I need to find Lee. No, sorry, it's Mike and Chris I need to find. Mike and Chris. So I need to find Mike and Chris. And that's Gil. We need to find Mike and Chris. That's John, Simon, Ricky, Clark. Mike and Chris. Come on, Mike and Chris. Obviously, they're going to be at the bottom where the hardest ones always are. There's Chris and Hank and Odell. So let's jump in here quickly and quickly open his desk. And there's the bottle of medicine. 19 bucks. And there was some other crap in there as well, but I mean, I'm not interested in that. Mike is the next guy I need to jump into his cell, and I'm going to do that quickly. It is morning roll call, so I need to hustle. Um, the guards haven't seen me yet, and he's got toothpaste, a bottle of medicine. Okay, so he, that thing is not in here, which means the playing card is obviously on the guy. So yeah, I need to hurry up and get to the roll call quickly, otherwise there's going to be issues. And uh, let's see, Greg has an issue. My dice, Chris is to blame, I'll take that quest for you. And Gil, he is unconscious at the moment, let me just throw him down there. <laughs> My light is on a vanishing act and I expect Odell is to blame. Perfect. Let's pick that up. Um, I don't want to buy anything from these guys in front of the guards. Obviously, there's a crafting note that'll tell you um, what you can craft with specific items. So if you've got, uh, I can't remember what it was. I think it was a toothbrush and a razor blade or something. And duct tape or whatever, you can put it all together. <coughs> okay, so now I need to find Chris and Odell. Let's have a look here. There's Chris's desk. So if I can get the dice here from Chris, that'll be a huge coup for me. Uh, I can get some extra money. Opening up that desk. The gods are a little suspicious of me. Um, but yeah. And then I need to find Odell's desk. Here it is right here. Let's quickly jump in here. Hopefully that's not Odell. Hopefully that's not him either. And there's the lighter that we needed, $18 added to our funds. Okay, so afternoon free period, what are we going to do? I want to find one of the guys who sells things. 